Okay, what you're looking at is a piece of wood. It's a crotch wood that uh, there's a limb. This is the tr main tree here. And then there's a limb that came off here. And you can sort of see that here. This is, I was going to make a clock out of this, but I'm in the process of making some knives. And I wanted to show the figure that you get from crotch wood and how beautiful it is. Um, I had already taken some wood from my grandmother's house, some crotch wood from my grandmother's house, and made a little knife out of it. And actually, if I match it up here, that's roughly where I got the crotch wood from. And you can see that little bit of figure that's right there. Now this piece came from a much, much smaller branch. This is actually bigger. The, this branch I got, this piece of crotch, was, piece, was a piece of firewood. So what I'm fixing to do now is show you how that crotch wood pops by just putting some polyurethane. Now the reason I'm putting polyurethane on it is I just cut this and this has been sealed for a long time so this is still fairly wet. I don't want this to dry out real fast so what I'm going to do is just wipe it. And here we go. Now watch this crotch wood just pop. It'll actually wind up soaking up some of this, but right there is where I'm going to take some knife blanks from. This portion right here, and possibly even this portion right here. Now, I don't know if you can see it or not. Yes, you can. Watch this other side that has the same interesting thing going on with it. This is just some nice, beautiful grain as it is, but this here has a very nice tiger stripe to it. Now this piece right here is quarter sawn because of how I cut the log. Another interesting thing to note is that inside of here, there are some actual pieces where I guess the grain split or something and it filled back in with, with uh, some of the tree resin. So there's some black lines right in here that are actually solid. They're not gaps or wormholes. So at any rate, I've done this long enough at 1080p, I might want to turn it off or this is going to be around 40 gigs. Thank you for watching and I'll show you a picture of the finished knife eventually. My name is Mike Myers and I approve this message.